Hey what's going on guys it's Moon here and today I've got another video for you guys about FIFA 13 and looking towards it and today we're going to be concentrating on who will be the best players in the game. Now this is going to include defenders, midfielders and attackers. Goalkeepers doesn't really matter because goalkeepers don't really change too much throughout the game only the rank had changed so but in, in defenders what you want to be looking for of course is a bit of pace as well so again the likes of Thiago Silva, Kalini. Again, a Barthe, of course, a right back or someone like that. But Thiago Silva and Kalini. Lucio was a good defender last year, but pace isn't going to be so much of an issue, I don't think, this year. I may be totally wrong, but that's what I'm th I'm thinking, what I've seen from the demo, what I've seen from some gameplay from like Gamescom and that. But So, hopefully, more more people like, say, Hummels and Subtit, who had like 70 odd pace last year, will become more and more better players. Again, with, say, from my point of view, Agger and Skirtle. I think Agger was about 69 pace last year. If his pace stays the same, I think he'll be an even better player this year to play with. And, of course, we'll move on to the midfielders now, because the defenders, again, they don't really change much from year to year. It's only the impact of pace this year that'll probably change the way people play with defenders or who will be, like, say, the top defenders this year. Midfielders, if you're going to be playing like a 4-2-3-1 formation or a 4-5-1 formation, 4-1-2-1-2, four, four, one, two, one, two, something like that with a whole midfielder there, I think someone like Perlo would be a fantastic player and someone who, who, even though he hasn't got much pace in the midfield and he doesn't go forward too much, he's going to be such an influential player, I think, in FIFA 13 and players like that, like a whole midfielder, a creative player, someone like, again, Xabi Alonso, Perlo, because they have such good control with the ball, they can pick a pass, and I think passing and control of the ball is going to be such a more important factor than, say, just outright pace and outright amazing shooting ability, even though Perlo and Alonso have got them. So I think those two players will be very important players in that team and very people... Um, People like them. Unfortunately, Gerard, from my point of view, I don't know why he's an 83 this year, but unfortunately he is. So I don't know how he's going to look. I've seen his stats on the Ultimate Team database, the FIFA 13 one. The stats look good, but for an 83, I don't know why he's been moved down to that. But otherwise, midfielders for the whole midfielders players, I think, are going to have more and more of an influential role in the way your team plays as if you play with a formation like that. For, for example, say you play 4 3 2 1, then you probably won't really notice it much. But again, I think those midfielders would be most important. And then you've got all your attacking midfielders, say like Nasri, David Silva, and all that. Of course, they're going to be good as well. But I, w I wanted to concentrate on the whole midfielders because I think they'll be more important in. FIFA 13 as well and attackers I think someone like Ibrahimovic will be really good this game for I, I don't know because again pace isn't an issue he's got really good control on the ball he's probably got a good shot on him good heading as well so I think Ibrahimovic will be one of the best players on the game this year he probably was disputed one of the best games last year or in FIFA 12 now because but his pace did let him down a bit because pace was such an influential factor in FIFA 12 Maybe that let him down a bit, but I think he's going to be really good. And of course, you can't ignore the likes of Messi and Ronaldo. But who will like be the new El Shirawi? Because I think El Shirawi is a seventy-six in this game. Correct me if I'm wrong in that. But again, who's going to be like the new El Shirawi? Say Silva, five-star skiller. So hopefully, guys, you want to leave your comments and blow and your thoughts who will be the best players in FIFA 13 who you're looking forward to playing with of course depends on your formation depends on your play style if you just want to go for outright pace and see if that works for you then you will you'll have to like to walk out Lennon and all that on your team but if you're more like me who wants to play a bit of football I'll be more inclined to go with say someone like Xabi Alonso or Pirlo so hopefully guys you enjoyed this video leave a like if you think deserved it subscribe if you haven't already and of course comment who you're looking forward to playing with in FIFA 13 and who you think will be the best players in the game of course Messi and Ronaldo will always be there thanks for watching the video